And on a day marked by the warmth of the holiday, it is anything but warm outside. The low temperature here in Madison was a frigid 12 below, but for anyone working outside, you don't have to tell them how cold it is because they know. News 3 reporter Dave Delosier joins us with one very cold story today, Dave. Yeah, you know, Michelle, anytime uh, you, you, you combine the bitter cold and water mains, it's really a bad combination. And today in Madison, there were five water main breaks. And when that happens, someone has to fix them, which means someone has a very, very cold job. We're always ready for it. Somehow, on a day like this, words just can't describe the cold. I'm uh, right in my uh, thermostat in my car said minus 10. Cold like this doesn't have to be described because you can feel it. Today, it's probably, um, if you ain't got thermal socks on, you can start feeling the cold in your feet, and you definitely can feel it in your nose and your face. So your face mask will be coming out here momentarily, too. It is one thing to work out in this kind of weather. It is another to do what Matt, Troy, and Pat do. They fix what Mother Nature breaks. And last night, it was so cold, five water mains gave up the ghost. Uh, Any time in the morning when you're not up and the phone rings, it's 99% of the time, it's, it's work calling, so. And the thing about water and this kind of cold, it doesn't stay water for long. It's not nice out, but it's our job, so that's what we do. It is definitely cold today, but uh, yeah, like I said, you come prepared, dress warm, have a change of clothes, because somebody's going to be getting wet here in a little bit. Pat would know because he gets to go from cold to cold in the wet. Just another day at the water department for us, you know. Two hours later and nine feet down, the break is finally fixed. Thanks to these guys, the neighborhood again has water. A little chilly down there. Not bad. But given how cold it is, it is safe to guess that this isn't what these guys wanted for Christmas. No, I'd rather be at home in the uh, nice warm house, but that's what I signed up for, you know, 20 years ago. So that's what I do every winter is what we do. Even on a day when the cold guarantees only one thing, they'll get to do this again. On to the next one, yes. Gotta tell you, it made me cold just watching those guys work. Now, with the cold continuing, Madison Water is asking residents to give them a little bit of a help. If you notice a significant drop in water pressure or see water bubbling up from the pavement, call their water break hotline. Oh my gosh. Well, thanks to those guys and thanks to you for letting us know their story because you were cold too, I'm sure, Dave. Not as cold as they were. <laughs> yeah. Not as cold as they were. Those guys, those guys earned their money today. There's no doubt about that. Oh my gosh. Well, we wish them well. Thanks, Dave. You betcha.